There you go, folks. That's how you do the challenge. See? Oh, and you thought I wasn't talking the whole time? How funny. I just want to show you an easy spot. You could go do this. I get a little sidetracked. Chit chatting with the wife, but. Uh, basically, you just pull up here and put that rescue truck or some vehicle in front of that door so they only have a little gap to come through, and then you just cap them when they come through the door. That's all. It'll take you five minutes, and this challenge will be done. Send your drone out there. And there's an ammo box right here next to me, if you notice. So We'll sit here and see how long we can stay in alert level four. Because we are in four, just in case you don't realize it. And, you know, you may die setting that vehicle up like I did. But it's all good. Oh, and I will show you real quick. I am on tier one mode too, see, just to show you guys, I'm not faking you out. I am on tier one mode, in extreme, like I normally play, but we'll sit here and see how many of these guys I can kill, and keep it at four. But I tell you, I find an easy spot to do this challenge for you guys, so you don't have to grieve it too much. You see me, I'm not sweating it too much. Where my ghosts are, I have no idea. They're probably all laying around dead. I better be recording too. If I'm not recording, I'm going to be pissed. Oh yeah, I'm still recording. Well, I can't look through my scope anymore. I'm not, I'm tripping. Oh, there we go. Hit the wrong key. I guess I could use this opportunity to go grab some more of these bolts. But nope, I'll got to pop up in the spec crates too here. If I can get away from here without dying. Oh, there's my guys. They're still alive, see? Cool. All right, I think we're, yeah, we're still in level four. Here they come. So I'm glad you guys will be happy to see that I knocked this challenge out so quick, quick for you guys. Since I know a lot of people are stressing over it, but nope, you can do this in five minutes. And you can see I'm not sweating sitting here. I can just sit here all day. There's an ammo box right next to me. So, For all of you that think it's hard being in tier 1 mode, extreme, and on or level 4, it's really not. It's all psychological, man. It's all in your freaking minds. Just like in combat. First time there, you shit your pants. <laughs> Basically. Literally some guys. But yeah, after a while. You're always scared. That never goes, but nope, same here.
But there is an ammo box right here, so you can just come right over here and grab some more bolts. Know what I mean? So, but yeah, we are in, we are in tier four. I mean, we are in alert level four. Just to let you guys know, I'm not I'm not faking you out. I could probably call in rebel support if I really wanted to mix mix stuff up a little bit here. Got a call to the rebels for some reinforcements. Get a little. I guess I can get my ghosts up if my ghosts are down. Should be one of my guys showing up here real soon. I was trying to run out. Oh yeah, I'm. Yeah, I know there's SAM sites too. Oh, it's gonna blow. Oh, we're still getting out though. <laughs> getting away oh that's that's the most important thing are we getting away see watch oh man that's a hell of a time for me to put my HTI away too I remember I put my HTI away when I started doing this video ah I think we might He's targeting us. Get to cover. Hell you go, see? Level 4 alert. Did our thing. Oh, uh, we still got Apache on our butt, but I think I can lose him too. Then I can open up my spec ops crates for you guys. Hell yeah. See, I told you I'd find an easy spot for you to do the thing, do the challenge, have a good time, not die. If we can break off from this helo. I think we can. I bet you I get into the water and lose them. Let's go back the other way. He's on us, man. My yeah, lose this copter, I'll open up my crates. But I told you we'd do the challenge with no problem. I told you I'd find an easy spot to do the challenge. There you go. Oh, here he comes. I am. I'm staying there to cover. We'll get away and I'll open up the spec op crates for you guys. Then I'll get this video up on YouTube. Everybody will be happy campers. They'll say, oh, Sarge found a cool spot for us to do the challenge. We won't die. He's after my ghost more than me, if you notice. Yeah, 
he's really not after me. He's after my ghost more than me. I don't think I've ever been chased this far. Oh, oops, let me turn on my night vision for you guys, sorry. I don't think I've been able to chase, been chased this far before either. All right, are we out of, out of chasing mode now for sure? Cool. All right, there you go, guys. All right. Oh, I know where we're at. We're at the rebel little rebel fishing fishing village thingy, Majigger. Right on, man. He's got lights over here too, so I can turn off my night vision. I think. Oh no, I'll turn my night vision on. That looks crappy. So there you go. See? Pop our thingy open. There's your third challenge, right? Kill ten targets completed, right? We'll open up our spec ops crates. See what type of see what type of goodies they gave us, right? But just to let you know, I was in tier one mode, okay, the whole time, tier one mode, right? So you know, I don't play that game with you guys. You know that. Say you completed, you know what? Tier tier one, tier one all the way, baby. Right on. Okay, well, let me get a screenshot real quick of this. I can put this up with the video so you guys know I'm legit. And kudos to everybody who gave me all the locations. Because if you look at my posts on uh, challenge number two, everybody was coming up with, like I said, every location I showed you on the map pretty much. You know, from the La Loma outpost to uh, FOB. I think Twigs D did FOB Butry. And um, a couple other people did. Uh, my subscribers, sorry if I don't get your name up here real quick. Did Jun and um, one of my other subscribers, I believe, did the same combat outpost I did because he said it was north of um, Ace Vindio off of a dirt road. So more than likely it was here. You could have done the shooting range because there's a fence all the way around. So they can only drive in. But nope, this was sweet. We got this knocked out. Let's open up the crates real quick for you guys. Show you what we got. Cool. A bear tattoo. Right on. I like that hat. I wish I'd get that hat in <laughs> the division. Snake skin. That's cool. Okay, what else do we got here? Big excitement. Ah, cool. The Doom Mask, man. Nice, nice. Ah, and the Arena Mask. Another mask. Nice. Amphibian. Cool looking skin. But I, hey, I'm glad I got the two masks. This one, I don't know if I'll wear this too much, but I know a lot of guys like it. And that monocle does work. This is pretty cool. The Doom Mask. Hey, man. Thanks for the free rewards. I appreciate that, man. So, again. It's real easy to do this challenge, you guys. Once you get to level four, just turn your HUD off and go ahead and do what you got to do. But yeah, just blow up the vehicles. Again, I appreciate everybody subscribing and clicking on that like button. And you see, this is a very fast one to do. It doesn't take very long to do at all. Just um, again, you go to this combat outpost right over here, right, right up on top of the mountain up here, right, and just start raising hell and get inside that little armory right there. Put a vehicle in front of the door, and you can sit there like me and just chill and shoot them, and it's all. Yeah, bro. I did it, man. Hell yeah. I did the solo challenge part three, man. We're rocking, man. Did you do your challenges yet? Probably not. Slacker. Okay. So, until I figure out something else for us to do here over the next couple weeks, this is Sergeant Nick Fury. As always, Ghost, I appreciate you guys subscribing. Again, hitting that like button, all that good stuff. And, um, as always, at ease, soldiers. Look at the camera, dude.